Marriages, like births, mark a new beginning. I want you to remember the promises that you are about to make and keep them with all of your heart. Cherish definitely has a nurturing heart, and Gabriel has just gotten himself a treasure. She is kind and fiercely loyal. She cares so deeply for the people that she loves. She displays Jesus in her love and in her honesty. Gabriel, your love for Jesus and your love for Cherish are evident in all that you do. We could not be more proud of you as the man you have become. I've been looking forward to this moment since the day you were born, Cherish. My first child, my one and only daughter. You're so beautiful. As I look at this beautiful woman before me in this lovely wedding gown, I can't help but remember the little girl that you were and the woman that you have become. Dearly beloved, we are gathered here in the sight of God and before His church to witness the union of this man and this woman in holy matrimony. I now ask, who gives this woman to be married to this man? And all I could sing a thousand love songs, but none would measure up to you. And all I could write a thousand stories. I vow to lead you humbly as I am led by God. I vow to put your needs above my own, honoring you with my time and energy because you're my beloved. I vow to seek God first each day so that he can direct our steps as a couple and as a family because you're my fellow believer. I vow to share all of my mind, body, and heart with you as long as I am alive. I vow to encourage you every day and I vow to give my all to you because you deserve it because we're one. I vow to commit to and love every part of who you are and who you will become as the years and journey of life change you. Now that Gabriel Austin Parker and Cherish Emily Rainwood have committed themselves to each other in holy matrimony, I pronounce them to be husband and wife in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Gabriel, you may kiss your bride. Forever, nowhere else to be 
It's no mystery that Gabriel, I know you and I aren't the most emotional people, but I just want to say that I love you and that I appreciate all that you've done throughout my life. Uh, cherish. If you are rethinking all of this, it's too late, so... <laughs> I love you both, and I'm excited for this new chapter of your lives. I know that God has really big plans for you, and I can't wait to see where He leads you. Gabriel, I was skeptical about you at first, and I know you know that. <laughs> Since those early days, you have loved, pursued, and honored, cherished in the good and the bad. I'm so excited to watch your relationship continue to deepen as you start this new chapter. You're the man that we have been praying for, for Cherish. May you always have walls for the wind, enough wind to blow your wind generator, tea by the fire, laughter to cheer you up, and God's daily blessings in both your lives. Here's to a wonderful wedding day and an even more marvelous marriage. <laughs>